Welcome everyone to Monday Night Raw, ladies and gentlemen. We need to go straight to the ring because we have already lost control of this show. This hardcore title is causing mayhem. As, and oh my god, what did I tell you? We have lost it here. Is Mankind, of course, who is the hardcore champion. Is all oh, look at Road Dog and Road Dog is trying to go on as Rikishi is trying to get Funaki the hell out of here right now. Why the hell is Funaki getting involved? Is, oh god, look at Funaki! And Funaki! Look at the kicks! Oh, he's and oh god, Rikishi, Rikishi, and oh god, Funaki! <laughs> Sent away there. His man, that's 24 7 rule. It really has. As, oh god, Funaki, he's trying to lift Rikishi, his road dog is all over. And, whoa, did you see Rikishi there? He just jumped in the air over a drop kick. Rikishi is still just trying to get Funaki out of here. It's no surprise that road dog is determined right now. As in, oh, Rikishi just ate the steel steps there. As, wait a minute, Mankind just took down, watch out, in the ring, and oh my god! And oh god. As Funaki! And oh, and Road Dog threw Funaki down. Oh, this 24 7 rule. Is Mankind, the current hardcore champion, is Rikishi. We want to really try to get these guys out the way here. And oh man. I see we are losing it. Absolutely losing it. As in Funaki now. As oh god. And he's been caught. Where the hell is mankind? As oh good god. As in, oh! Look at Funaki taking it to Mankind of all people. As in, oh, Funaki just bounced off him. As Mankind and Road Dog is on oh, a brutal neck range by Rikishi. As, oh man, oh man. Rikishi is just trying to take out Road Dog right now. Mankind is the champion. As I said, we are losing control here. This open the show, and these guys were already in the ring. Let's look at Mankind. He's just having himself a little chill. Is up count a long time, Rikishi. No, oh, I'm good. God. <laughs> As Funaki hitting his way out here. As Funaki with Mankind and... Oh my god, did you see that? As... Oh, nobody home. As in... Good god, he just took out the knee there. Oh god. We are losing it here, absolutely losing it. Look at Road Dog. His old Funaki. Oh, good God! Is he trying to take down Road Dog here? These guys. And Funaki, of all people, hitting anything that moves. It's all, look at, look at Mankind! That mandible claw there. That shot by Funaki there as Funaki, where the hell is Funaki going with Rikishi? It's, oh man, that tornado DDT there. And, oh God, what a drop kick. Oh god. Oh, Road Dog. 
That pale drive on there. Right, look at Funaki getting right on to Mankind. There's Road Dog now with the pump handle. As he's pinning. And Road Dog is the new hardcore champion. And Rikishi. Road Dog is the new hardcore champion. As this fight continues here. Oh, God. And oh, Funaki down again. Is Rikishi. Sending on. Rikishi knows. Look at Road Dog though, fighting back also. There's Funaki. Back up at his feet here. As look at Rikishi. Is Rikishi. As a oh, Naki tried to run through him and failed miserably. And oh good god, that is not working for Funaki here. As Road Dog and Road Dog catching Rikishi. And oh, what a right hand! As oh, God, Road Dog got Funaki there and drops him down. Oh, poor Funaki. Thank you, gone. Funaki gone. <laughs> well, Funaki was taken care of, but Rikishi still in the ring here. Going at it with the road dog. Now, road dog. Trying to get rid of Rikishi here. There's all Rikishi. And Rikishi. And oh, Rikishi with Road Dog. God! And oh, Road Dog was able to slide out of it somehow. Is Rikishi determined right now? Is all oh, Road Dog try to slip under? Oh man. And Rikishi. Road Dog needs to grab that belt and run. I don't know why he's staying on Rikishi here. Funaki's been taken out. Mankind uh, seems to have went away. Love to fight another day. I'm sure Mankind will do. Look at Road Dog here's Rikishi determined to get this hardcore title right now as he went for a headbutt and gets smacked there. As we just look at Road Dog. And Rikishi throwing him down. But look at Road Dog man getting right back on Rikishi. As off that apron. And another huge right. And off the steps. Oh man, these guys just going at it. There's Road Dog here, Rikishi is busted open, as was Mankind, the blood was trickling out of his mask. As Road Dog, man, 
grab the belt and run, you crazy son of a bitch. Is Rikishi out the way of that one there as Rikishi just scoops up Rodon down with that big Samoan drop there. And Rikishi hooking the leg here, trying to become hardcore champion. Rikishi pulling Road Dog to his feet. As on Road Dog. No, oh, Road Dog with the low kick. And Road Dog with a pump handle drop there. As you don't need to pin him, Road Dog. The referee's just counting it. He's already the hardcore champion. Well, Rikishi kicked out. This isn't. Well, I was going to say it's not an official match, but technically it is, is Road Dog going up top once again here. This is if Road Dog's determined to prove himself. A huge cross body. What are you doing, Road Dog? You're not a high flyer. Well, not in that type of way. And again, this time he lands that huge elbow. As Road Dogs determined to pin Rikishi right now, who kicks out again. You're the hardcore champion, Road Dog. Just take the belt and run. As Road Dog again into Rikishi. He is determined. Is oh good God the brutal McLinch. Is all oh, Rikishi though. Hitting out of it here. There's Rikishi. And, oh no, see this is why you should have ran, Road Dog. This is why you should have ran. Oh no, it's the stink face. Oh good God. It's Rikishi and oh, Road Dog. Diving under there. Is, oh, he got caught there. Is, oh, God, look at, oh my God, don't sit on his back. Oh, he let it go, and Rikishi, he wants to become the champion here. Is Rikishi. And the Rikishi driver. As he hooks the leg of Road Dog. Oh, my God. <laughs> What the hell is going on with these two? Rikishi determined to become hardcore champion. Road Dogs actually determined to pin Rikishi right now. Not able to hit his way out there. That's all Rikishi. Oh man, he's. Road Dog just seems determined to actually beat Rikishi right now. Road Dog's got more balls than brains. Road Dog really wanting to prove himself right now as he is all over Rikishi. As those jabs as Rikishi with the right hand. And Rikishi flown him again. I think Road Dog's going to seriously regret all of this. As, oh, watch out, he got caught there as Road Dog. And Road Dog putting Rikishi back in the ring again. We have lost absolute control here. As, wait a minute, Road Dog is stalking him out. And Road Dog going to try and drop Rikishi again here. Pump handle. And again, he hooks the leg of Rikishi. Good God almighty! <laughs> Rikishi! This, I'm just, it's just insane! Is Rikishi kicked out again there? And oh my good God, what a super kick that was! And oh, that huge headbutt! It's, oh God! Road Dog still fighting back. This is absolutely nuts. This was supposed to be a small brawl. 
Oh, Mann. Road Dogs determination right now is unbelievable. Determined to get a victory here over Rikishi. This isn't an actual singles match. This is just an absolute brawl that kicked off. Is all oh, watch out though, Road Dog just gets scooped up by Rikishi! Another Rikishi driver, that's got to be it! Road Dog, who just won the hardcore title from Mankind, has just lost it to Rikishi. Why didn't you take the belt and run? Oh my god! Why wouldn't you just run? Absolutely insane! Funaki tried, he really did. And Rikishi, the man who, well, felt like he did win the hardcore title last week when Undertaker just hung it. Hung it from the ceiling. But only for the match to get restarted and Mankind got away with it. Well, it's one week later and we have had two hardcore champions, the Road Dog, then Rikishi. This 24 7 thing is getting out of control. being joined by the game who last week didn't get it done lots to talk about tonight lots of injustices in this damn company everyone knows I should be going to Wrestlemania as the World Wrestling Federation champion You can all continue your screaming, I don't care. This is the McMahon Helmsley era. This is our faction. This is our company. This is our show. And know what? You're damn right we can do whatever we want. So, rock, test. You know why I'm out here, because I want a match. It doesn't matter with whom I can tear apart anybody on this roster. But as for you two, I am announcing that I will be in the main event of WrestleMania. The world legend is interesting, thinking about the people it gets wasted on. I am a living legend and I will be in the main event of WrestleMania. Me and Stephanie have agreed that show needs main event caliber and you don't get more main event than the Cerebral Assassin, Triple H. But don't you idiots worry that we're hoping for your mediocre main event at WrestleMania. I will be in that match to save it. As for tonight, you can get a peek at what it could have been. The Rock and Test, used two can go one-on-one -on -one tonight. The Triple H just inject. You can't just put yourself in the main event of WrestleMania. Triple H has just added himself to the match. You can't throw his weight around like this. Well, Triple H has added himself to the main event and The Rock and Test have been booked for tonight's main event. So what should have been the WrestleMania main event has now been changed. Triple H added himself in. I guess we're going to get a sneak peek tonight with Test and The Rock. As for right now though, Big Show last week went one on one with Chris Benoit. Benoit was told if he won he would, he would get a shot at the Intercontinental Championship. Well, he failed, so he asked, he requested the match once again. Triple H was uh, reluctant, and so was Stephanie, to give him this match because he didn't fulfill his part of making sure that Triple H left with that title last week. Although Tess did help uh, <laughs> The Rock in that part as well. Well, Benoit going to get another shot here. Even that, we saw Ken Shamrock come out. 
Last week, man, Shamrock came out mid-match. Got in the big show's face. And his opponent, from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. As here we go, these guys. As big show. No time wasted on that one. As big show. And oh, look at these body shots. And oh, right off the chest. Big show in control here is in the way. Wait a minute, and there's there's Shamrock again. Ken Shamrock again here. Is. Oh, wait a minute. And over the ropes. There's Big Show going after Benoit here. There's, oh, wait a minute. Shamrock, what the hell is Shamrock playing at? And Shamrock's in the ring. As in, oh, and Shamrock just dropped Benoit there. It's all oh, good God, a neck wrench. It's Big Show. And look at Shamrock here. Benoit got in the way. Shamrock drop kicked Benoit, trying to get to the Big Show as Big Show is bailing out of the ring here. Shamrock was wanting his, it looked like he was going after the Big Show there. Benoit got in the way and he just drop kicked the head off of him. As Ken Shamrock seems to have his eyes on the big show here. Well, backstage there, people, uh, Ken Shamrock, he got grabbed. Then, did, then so did Benoit. Benoit not happy at being hit by Shamrock. Shamrock making it clear. He is here, he is back in the World Wrestling Federation and he wants to be a hardcore champion again. It's that Earth. simple. From Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. As well, there's one half of the tag team champions. Chris Jericho making his way to the ring here. Jericho, Jericho and Godfather. Wondering who's going to come after the tag team gold. And of course, they faced the Hardy Boys last week. They got the victory. As in, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. There's, wait a minute, wait a minute. Watch out, watch out. And, oh my good God. Jericho, man, what a smash he just took. Jericho back in his feet here, he's coming right after. As in, oh God, and wait a minute, there's up on the stage, Godfather making his way out here. As oh, Devon sees him coming. But look at Jericho right now, not in a good way, he is being beaten on. As Devon has just met Godfather on the rampway there, they are going at it. As our Bubba with a steel chair, we saw Edge and Christian take a beat down last week. And it looks like Bubba with steel chair in hand here. As in, oh good God. And Bubba is beating the holy hell. Out of Jericho with a steel chair here. My God. Jericho, they're cheering for Jericho as best they can, but it doesn't really matter right now. As Bubba is just beating Chris Jericho down.
Chris Jericho, his godfather, so busy with Devon over there. And oh man, and a bob a bomb. Oh, wait a minute, watch out, watch out, Bubba. His godfather's got Devon over there. Oh my god! As this steel chair assault continues out here. This is just. Man, Jericho is down and out right now. Is the assault with a steel chair. Is Devon, man. These damn Dudleys. And oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. And oh, man. What a drop. And the Dudleys just laid out the tag team champions. Last week it was Edge and Christian who were meant to challenge the tag team champions. They were meant to get a title shot. The Dudleys stopped that from happening this week. They've actually taken out the tag team champions. The Dudley boys, man. Just going after them. Here man, oh man, this is terrible. Absolute beatdown. Same as Edge and Christian John last week put through the tables. The this week, steel chair assault on Jericho and Godfather. And watch out! And the Hardy Boys! The Hardy Boys just came through the crowd! And they're going after the Dudleys now! Oh man, and the Hardys, they've had their issues with the Dudley Boys, that is for damn sure! And it doesn't look like it is ending! Oh for God's sake, Jeffy Mora! <laughs> Holy good God! Didn't mean that there. Man, these guys are all over the joint. There's old Jeff. And Jeff is taking it to Devon right now. He really is. And oh! And God, face planted there. It's all, watch out. Jeff, with a twist of fate. And oh man, they've got wood. They have got wood. Oh god, they are going after the tables. And oh man, oh man. There's Bubba. Going right after here. There's old Bubba behind. And oh Bubba. And oh Bubba sees the wood. And Bubba is going to start setting up shop. Oh, watch out though. Get caught there. And oh. And good God, man, kicking that table over there. And oh, man, these guys. Oh, watch out, watch out, Devon. Oh man, it would appear. Look at Jeff. We've seen him do this before. Apparently, he did do it at some point in his bloody life, but like, apparently we're not allowed to do it now. As Devon is a little bit too preoccupied right now, and he is not concentrating. 
on the game at hand. The, oh my God, Jeff! Oh, Jeff! Just put himself face first through a table. It's Matt Hardy now. These brawls that we've got are terrible. It's Matt Hardy, twist of fate. And oh man, these guys. There's Bob up. Oh, they can't do fucking anything right, can they? There's Bubba now. And oh, watch out, and Bubba with the cutter. There's Jeff. Trying to do whatever he can right now. And oh. Is all oh man. And oh my god, it is literally like trying to watch retards work. It is just insane. Why you can't just set up a table normally in this game anymore is ridiculous. Is Bubba into the ring here? But as he comes in, Jeff is lying in wait. And Bubba is not in a good position here. Jeff Hardy is up high. Oh, good God. Is, oh, watch out. Swan Ton bomb through the table as Devon goes through the other side. Oh, man. And the Hardys. Paying back the Dudleys. Oh man. A chair attack, a table attack, these guys. Oh, it took longer than I'd liked, but it was actually quite a cool little ending how that worked. And the Hardy boys laying out the Dudleys there through the tables. Last week, Edge and Christian were assaulted, put through tables by the Dudleys. This week, the tag team champions have been attacked, laid out with the steel chairs by the Dudleys. And then the Hardys decided they had enough, and they took out the Dudleys with their own tables. All right, we are back here, people. We are going to be joined. This man now knows he's got the snake at Mania. One on one. The snake is alone with no backup. As Undertaker's in the ring. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Through the crowd. It's all oh, God. And look at Jake. Look at Jake. Jake the Snake, bat in hand, and he is pummeling, absolutely pummeling, the Undertaker with that bat. And Jake the Snake with an absolute cheap shot on the Undertaker there. And Jake the Snake just assaulted the Undertaker, absolutely laid him out. Oh, Snake, do you realise what you are doing? You are awakening a beast you do not want to mess with. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Women's Championship. Alundra well, Blaze has offered to defend the championship tonight against Lita. 
Lita never really got a rematch for the championship after she lost it, so Alundra said, screw it. Alundra is a fighting champion. As uh, she threw out that challenge to China, but China... China not uh, wanting to compete for the women's championship. She thinks it. She thinks it's beneath her. It's that's just as, just the case. As Alundra Blaze wants to convince China to go one on one with her. Well, here comes Alundra Blaze. Well, she wants China at Mania. What an interesting match that would be to the most dominant women you've seen in this industry. Not afraid to mix it up with the men. Just a shame we can't do that in this. I'd love to have Challenger. China beating the hell out of all the guys. I highly doubt they'll ever bring that back into the game though. This day and age. Well, Lita wanted a shot. Alundra was more than happy to oblige. As it all, Lita, oh man, what a spear there. And well, Lita. And Alita with another one. Well, we still got Test in the Rock to come. It'd be an interesting match. It should have been what the Mania main event is. Triple H has injected himself into the WrestleMania main event, throwing the power around. As a one drop. Not even watching in the back, man. China just doesn't doesn't care. It's more interest in getting involved in this. Alundra's trying to convince her to take the challenge. As Lita caught with the arm there. I would love to well, be fair Lita wins back this women's championship right now that'll put the whole China Alundra Blaze thing to bed straight away as Lita oh Alundra caught the leg there Alundra has been in some form lately that is for damn sure Oh man, smashing Lita right off the canvas. And oh, 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 Lita able to slip out of that one there. There's all Lita caught her and a twist of fate. The team extreme and look at Lita wasting little time here, getting right up the top rope. And Lita gonna go for the Lita assault. Oh my God, Lita might get it back here. She might actually get the women's championship back as she hooks the leg of Alondra Blaze. Who gets this shoulder? Oh my God, can you believe it? The twist of fate, the Lita assault. There's Lita. Oh my, is she going to go for this again? No, 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 Lita. Something else on the mind. As Lita. Oh, she got caught there and oh, she got planted there. 
Oh, I think she was going for that Hurricane Rana, but that was not to be. As Alondra sends her into the corner. Oh, God, man. Let's all do this to Trish Stratus through a table. It's no way out. And oh, man. Ah, and she might be looking to follow this up here. And Alundra, who somehow kicked out in that elite assault, plants the German. And the shoulders are down. And Lita somehow able to just cap out of it. And Alundra getting right back onto her. And oh, wait, I think Alundra, she's got some Lita ideas going through her head. Top rope flies through the air with the elbow drop. And another cover here. And Lita, yet again, able to get the shoulders up. Is it all in the Lundra? Well, he's matching Lita, that's for damn sure, with the risky maneuvers. As caught with the elbow there. And it's Lita right on to it. And Lita. Lita fired up right now. And oh man, and the Lundra. With the right hand there, sending her right back into the corner again. And caught with the elbow. And... Oh, Lita going to do a power bomb of her own right over into the bridge. The shoulders are down on Lundra. It would just pop out of it. As Lita, another twist of fate. Straight into the cover. And Lita might actually have it back here. And oh my good God. They're putting Road Dog and Rikisha to shame. Who am I? No, they're not. No, they're not quite at that level yet. As Lita, though, looking for the finale right now. Top rope. Here she comes. Lita Salt for a second time. Stays right on top of her. And oh my good God. Lita pounding the canvas in absolute shock and disbelief. Lita wondering what she needs to do. As Lita still staying on her here. And oh, and Alundra with a drop kick there. As, oh, watch out! Alundra, round the bag, German suplex connects! And oh, man, just like that. Oh my god, Alundra, oh, please. I thought she was actually going to lose there. How the hell did Alundra, please, kick out of all of that? We said she's been on some top form recently, but my god. She landed that second German out of nowhere. And Alundra, please, retains the women's championship. Man, did she fight to retain that as we always see an image backstage. China is watching. But she doesn't seem too impressed. We all know what Alundra Blaze wants. She wants China. She wants the ultimate challenge at WrestleMania. But China just isn't interested in fighting for the women's championship. Will that happen? Stone Cold Steve Austin joining us here. And Stone Cold Steve Austin. Well, we never saw Austin last week, but uh, obviously no way out. He came up short against Test. Test proven himself. What's on Austin's mind?
Well, I wish I could come out here, do the usual, crack some jokes, have a beer, but unfortunately, Austin has to face reality. Stone Cold Steve Austin ain't booked for WrestleMania. There's nothing in sight. The truth is, Stone Cold Steve Austin doesn't know what to do. He has no opponent. Now, I've been hearing murmurs around the locker room. Trying to say that good old Stone Cold Steve Austin has passed it. Now, you see, unfortunately, I can't just add myself to a main event at WrestleMania. But the truth is, it looks like Austin might just have to sit and have a beer in the crowd with the rest of you fine people at WrestleMania. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. That can't be. There's no way. There's no way. Oh my God. He's Hulk Hogan is back in the World Wrestling Federation. He is fired up. Hulk Hogan. Look at him. He's back. Hulk Hogan is here. He's back in the WWE. Hulk Hogan and the crowd is in shock so is Austin Austin is in shock is Hogan is jumping around so big man you decided that you have nothing to do at Wrestlemania well let the Hulkster let you know that Hulk Hogan wants to go one-on-one -on -one with Stone Cold Steve Austin at WrestleMania. Oh, if you wanted to get my attention, you definitely just did. Hulk Hogan versus Stone Cold Steve Austin. I ain't gonna waste any time here. You're on. There's something in the air tonight, brother. Guys, can you smell it? Smells like pure legendary match status. WrestleMania, Hulk Hogan, Steve Austin. It is a dream match. The faces of two different companies colliding. See, I'm back in the World Wrestling Federation and I knew who I was coming to get. Let's recap this. See, if you're here, it's because you got kicked out of the other one. And I'll tell you right now, Hogan, if you think you're going to WrestleMania to put me down and get above me, it is a different time, Hogan, and your politics ain't going to be working in the World Wrestling Federation anymore. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you've been paying attention this historic moment. Hogan and Austin in the ring together. You are witnessing history in the making. You know what, Austin? I ain't here to do those things anymore. Hulk Hogan is here for the people, for the fans, and to give the fans a dream match. Oh, here's the deal, Hogan. I'm ready to go anywhere, any time. You better believe it. Hell, WrestleMania might be the grandest stage, but I'm kind of tempted to open up a can of Lupas on the red and yellow right now. Oh, wait, you got called out in front of the world. Now, Austin, I've got nothing but respect for you. And I tell you right now, Austin, WrestleMania, we are still in the show. Hogan, Austin, one-on-one, -on -one, first time ever. Hulkamania will run wild again. Oh, Hogan, you know what your problem is? You're so used to always getting your own way. 
You know what? You're right. Hulkamania. Beer mania. I don't care. But Hogan, WrestleMania, I'm going to put you down just as quickly as Shawn Michaels did. Oh, cheap shot. All right. We've both said a lot of things. But you know what, Hogan? I'll tell you your face. I do respect what you've done in this business. It's good to see you in the red and yellow again. But Hulkamania will not run wild. Because I'm going to arrive, raise hell, and leave. And Hogan, Stone Cold Steve Austin, will put you down. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, we have just got a huge, huge match. WrestleMania, Austin and Hogan. Austin, Austin, stunner, stunner, Stone Cold stunner. He stunned Hogan, he stunned Hogan. Oh man, Austin laying down the woodwork. Austin and Hogan are going to meet at WrestleMania and Austin just stunned Hulk Hogan. Striking first, not last. Austin letting Hogan know what he's up against. Austin and Hogan, WrestleMania, and Austin has already struck the first blow. Well, man, what a huge WrestleMania announcement. It would also have been the perfect Making way to end way to the, the show. <laughs> but unfortunately, I can't do a promo to end the show. Well, the European champion, Test. Just didn't know them walking down with him. Triple H and Stephanie have made their way out here. As Test, the Royal Rumble one up, now known at WrestleMania, a triple threat match has been made. Triple H using the power of Stephanie, his wife, to inject himself into the WrestleMania main event well this should have been what we were going to see at Mania Rumble winner versus champion is Kurt Angle who is not happy at Triple H injecting himself in he still hasn't had his rematch for the title Triple H has said to Kurt Angle you know you could be, we could make you the referee at WrestleMania. And if you make sure I leave with the gold, there's no reason why I wouldn't happily give you the first shot. It's Cut Angle. I don't think Cut Angle wants to be the referee though. He wants his shot at the title. It's as simple as that. What should have been the WrestleMania main event we are getting tonight at WrestleMania Triple H will be in on this, it will be a triple threat match. And well, The Rock taking it to test right now. Uh, champion versus champion right now. As Tess, the Royal Rumble winner, the current European champion. Got that high profile win over Stone Cold Steve Austin. There's Test. Even last week, man, Test got the big win over Kurt Angle, although uh, <laughs> The Rock did play a little part in that match, although Test did return the favour by helping The Rock in his title match as well. Making the odds a little bit more even. Guys, all oh, Tess scoops up the rock, lays him out. Test right now, it's non title, but if he was to defeat the current champion, imagine how confident Test is going to feel going into WrestleMania. The last couple of weeks, wins over Cut Angle. 
and Stone Cold Steve Austin. He even had wins over the likes of Chris Benoit, who he took the European title from. Wins over men the size of Rikishi, the current hardcore champion. As Test. And I'll, and I'll wait a minute here. And Kurt Angle getting the attention of Test right now. As, and well, the Rock's back on his feet. The Rock, Test turned his back. Rock's not going to not take advantage. As the Rock. That belly to belly there. Getting him right back up on his feet again here as the Rock just picking him up and taking him down. Picking him up and taking him down. As the Rock again up on the feet here and the Rock. Might be good for everyone's second favourite move here right on the top rope. And the Rock is all over test right now as Rock bottom. And a Rock bottom. As, and look at Triple H. And Triple H is up on the apron. In the face of the Rock right now. What the hell is Triple H playing at? As wait a minute though. But now Test going to take advantage here. And Test. Oh my good God. Did you see that? But, but look at Kurt Angle. What the hell are they all playing at? What a boot that was from Test. He threw the rock up in the air. And just caught him with a huge boot. Test though getting right back on the rock here and another power slam. As Rock, I push him off here. It's the Rock right on to him, took him down. The Rock jumps right into the cover. He's all watch out, Test. And oh, we took down the big show with that move. As, oh, wait a minute. And now Kurt Angle again on me. What the hell is Triple H and Kurt Angle playing at? As the Rock back his feet. His old test went to take a, a swing at Kurt Angle there, but the Rock came right up behind him. And oh, wait a minute. Rock now is stalking out Test. Going to go for a second. Rock bottom. As in Triple H, what the hell are these guys doing? What in the actual? Is the Rock now getting right back on the test here with these close lines? And test in the Rock. Have been going at it in this match as well. Went under their test. Cut angle and Triple H getting constantly involved in this match. And oh, wait a minute. T Triple H, he just put a steel chair. He's all, oh, watch out. He just kept up. But no, oh, he comes off in the rock right in the midsection. And test came off the top rope. Is Rock. Oh, went under for a rock bottom there. Test just pushed them off. Is all waving it and Test. Oh, I'm trying to get rid of that steel chair. But the Rock going right back after him here. Is all, watch out. Good caught. And, oh, I thought he was going to gut rage power bomb him there. Would have been right in the chair. Is it all oh, right to the eyes there? Is the referee getting rid of that steel chair? Is Test now? And Test, well he was up the top rope moments ago, it looked like he might have been thinking that flying elbow, that might be what he's thinking now. He's on the top rope, flying elbow through the air. Into the cover, he might be about to pin the champion here. Oh, the rock kicked out. Man, oh man, Test must have thought he had it there. And oh, Test, 
He's getting that huge leg and big boot ready. And oh, he floored the rock. He floored him. The champ is down. His test hooks the leg of the World Wrestling Federation champion. And test just pinned the rock. Oh my God, what a huge, huge victory for Test. Don't get me wrong, the constant interference and distractions. But my God, did Test and Rock just keep going? Test, man. Rock Bottom's connected. He got out of that Rock Bottom, though. The rock kicking out of that flying elbow. But Test, is, winner, is this what would have happened at WrestleMania? Is this what would have been? Would Test have faced The Rock and won the championship one on one? We'll never know, because at WrestleMania, Triple H has injected himself into the main event. It will be a triple threat. All I know is Test just defeated, pinned the People's Champion, the World Wrestling Federation Champion, The Rock. Like, share and subscribe, leave those comments down below and I'll see you in the next episode.